Hello Cancer, Sun Moon Rising and Venus Signs. Kamusta kayo? Sana po ay nasa mabuti kayong kalagayan. Welcome back po sa Star Tarot. Kung bago kayo dito, welcome din kayo. Thank you sa inyong support. I truly appreciate it. God bless you all. Pauna mensahe ni Cancer, I truth. See your light, know your power, have the courage to walk the truth. Ayan. So, huwag kayong mahiya. Huwag kayong magdalawang isip na ilabas, no? I-share sa ibang tao yung ano ninyo, yung inyong sariling truth. Ang inyong totoong pagkatao, ang totoong nararamdaman ninyo, ano yung mga talents, skills, and gifts ninyo. Don't hesitate to show that to the world. Don't hesitate to uh, share it with other people. Cancer. What else? We have vibration. Your vibration is being raised to higher levels. You are connected to cosmic intelligence. Para kayong ano ngayon, in sync with the divine, in sync with the universe. No? At mataas yung inyong vibration. Uh, kapag mataas ang vibration natin, cancer, napaka-powerful natin. No? Uh, we have the, the power to manifest whatever we want to manifest. Yun ang energy na, na na-attract natin kapag tayo ay high vibe, kapag tayo ay masaya, excited, in love, yung mga ganun. No? So, what else? We have advancement. A strong energy is propelling you forward. Follow the steerings of your heart. Ayan, so pausad na kayo, no, Cancer, there is advancement, there is progress, there is growth, there is um, uh, pag-evolve ninyo dito. Now is the time na merong humahatak sa inyo patungo doon sa inyong pag, pag-grow, no. Uh, sundin ninyo ang, ano, ang inyong inner voice, sundin ninyo ang inyong intuition dito because you are being um, guided here to where you need to go or you where you need to be ano, cancer. So, tignan natin kung ano pa ang ganap. We have boundaries. Put a ring around yourself and your energies. Ayan. So, sobra siguro kayong mabait, sobra kayong compassionate, sobra kayong matulungan to the extent na at some point ano, naaabuso kayo ng mga tao sa paligid ninyo. At some point siguro Parang sumusobra na, lumalampas na sa limitasyon yung mga tao na nasa paligid ninyo. Kaya inibitahan kayo ngayon na mag-ano na kayo, mag-set uh, kayo ng inyong uh, healthy boundaries so that ma alpa, mapangalagaan ninyo ang inyong mga relationship with other people. No? Para hindi na kayo maabuso, hindi na kayo maapak-apakan sa inyong toes, kumbaga, no, Cancer? Breathe. Inhale stardust, exhale magic. Ayan. So, most likely, exhausted kayo, cancer. No? Pagod na kayo. Pagod na kayong mag-isip. Pagod na kayong ma- uh, makaramdam ng nababypass kayo. Pagod na kayong maapak-apakan ng ibang tao. Pagod na kayo physically, mentally, emotionally. No, cancer. Kaya, you need to take a breather. Kailangan ninyo munang huminga. No, kailangan nyo munang magpahinga, mag-relax, mag-chill muna kayo so that you can get the, the balance back in your life. No? So, take a breather. Maaaring punong-puno na din ang isip ninyo. Busy kayo sa pag-iisip. Maaaring punong-puno na yung, yung dibdib ninyo sa kung ano mang bagay, ano man ang inyong nararamdaman na parang sinusolo nyo lang. No? So, maybe you are so tired, no? Cancer, you are so tired na ngayon. Kaya kailangan ninyo na magpahinga. The sun rise to the occasion. This is really beautiful dahil ano na ito, um, Cancer, magiging maayos na din ang lahat. Eventually, you are going to rise above your situation dito. Mababalot na kayo ng diwanag. Mababalot na kayo ng clarity, ng enlightenment. And you'd be able to figure out what you need to do right now. Kasi parang nalilito kayo, no? Uh, ang iba sa inyo, super confused what you are going to do. What you need to do right now. Ano ang dapat ninyong isipin? Ano ang dapat ninyong gawin? Pero ngayon, no, mababalot kayo ng liwanag. You will be enlightened. You will be receiving clarity of mind dito. At mafigure out ninyo what is best for you to do right now.
No? So, good luck. And that's all I have for you for today. Thank you for watching. Love and light. Namaste. Hello, is Scorpio. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Kamusta kayo? Sana po yung nasa mabuti kayong kalagayan. Welcome back po sa Star Tarot. Kung bago kayo dito, welcome din kayo. Thank you sa inyong support. I truly appreciate it. God bless you all. Paunang mensahe ninyo ay navigate. Beacons of light in the night sky are there to guide you. You are so blessed, Scorpio. You are so lucky and blessed. You are divinely guided. No? You have the guidance of the divine. You have the guidance of the spirit realm. Maring sa ngayon, parang pakiramdam ninyo siguro in sync din kayo sa, sa universe. You know? Mataas ang vibration ninyo. Yung ganon. So that's really beautiful. Take charge. Don't wait for the stars to align. Reach up and arrange them the way you want. Ayan. So, huwag na kayong maghintay, no? Nang, ang tawad dito, don't, don't wait for other people to decide for yourself. Don't allow other people or don't wait for other people to tell you what to do, no? Uh, kayo na, no? Take charge of your life. Take charge of yourself. This is your life, so you need to decide for your own self, di ba? Um, Uh, gawin nyo na ngayon kung ano yung gusto ninyong gawin. No? Provided that it is um, according to the divine plan. So, it is important to listen. No? It is important for you to listen to your intuition. It is important for you to follow what your intuition is telling you. Because for sure, may, may guidance kayo. Di ba? Meron tayong navigate energy. So, ibig sabihin nito na meron kayong mga uh, intuitive messages. Siguro, vision or... Uh, signs, synchronicity, symbols na pinapadala sa inyo ang universe to guide you on how you are going to navigate your uh, current circumstances sa ngayon. Kaya, um, you are ano, you are entitled to take charge. You know, kayo na bahala sa sarili ninyo sa ngayon. Kayo na mag sa kung ano ang, ang uh, gusto ninyo, ba? Diba? You have thrived. That's enough space for the moon and her stars not to tear each other down. Panahon na para mag-thrive, si Scorpio. Panahon na para sa growth. Panahon na para mag-evolve kayo into the best version of yourself. And for you to, ano, to expand, di ba, Scorpio? So, take advantage of those opportunities dahil for sure, merong mga iba't ibang opportunities and possibilities that are knocking on your door na sa ngayon or maaring parating para, you know, magkaroon na kayo ng pagkakataon na mag-thrive, mag-evolve, mag-progress, di ba? Uh, mag, ano, mag-grow. So, what else? Scorpio, we have no limitations. You are a celestial being with unlimited potential. There is much for you to share. See? Sobrang ganda. Sobrang ganda. Parang pinapamukha sa inyo na universe dito na you are, un you have unlimited potential, Scorpio. Kaya huwag kayong mag-atubili. Huwag kayong panghinaan ng loob. Huwag kayong mag-procrastinate. Huwag kayong magdalawang isip because you have unlimited potential. You have so much to share sa mundo. You have so much in you. No? Ang dami mong bit-bit, kumbaga, na talents, skills, and gifts. You have so much, uh, you have so many tricks, no? kumbaga, on your sleeves para kayo ay magtagumpay sa buhay, para kayo ay mag-grow, para kayo ay mag-evolve, diba? There is so much potential in you. Okay? You just tap into it, no? Scorpio, at magtatagumpay kayo. We have gratitude, universal love shines through the miracles of life all around you. And ang daming blessings na maaaring parating dito sa inyo, Scorpio. Kaya nire-remind kayo dito ng universe na maging grateful kayo. Practice gratitude attitude dahil kapag... Um, nagpa-practice kayo ng gratitude attitude, you know, meron ditong ano, meron ditong pintong magbubukas para sa iyo, para sa mas maraming blessings, para mas sa mas maraming prosperity and abundance, no, na para thing sa inyo. We have release, release anything that keeps you from your path of authenticity. Ayun, parang fall season sa buhay ninyo ngayon, Scorpio. Panahon na para mag ng buhay ninyo, ng sarili ninyo. It is about time not to let go anything and everything that doesn't serve your highest good. It is time not to let go 
anything and everything na hindi naman nakakatulong sa iyo, hindi naman nakakasupport ng inyong best interest, hindi nakakasupport ng inyong highest good. Okay? Scorpio, that's all I have for you for today. Thank you for watching Love and Light. Namaste. Hello, Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus Signs. Kamusta kayo? Sana po'y nasa mabuti kayong kalagayan. Welcome back po sa Star Tarot. Kung bago kayo dito, welcome din kayo. Thank you sa inyong support. I truly appreciate it. God bless you all. Pisces, paunang mensahe ninyo ay eternity. Give yourself permission to slow down. Sobrang sipag siguro ninyo. Sobrang busy. Sobrang dami ninyong ginagawa. Pisces, okay? Give yourself permission to slow down because you need it right now, okay? Kailangan ninyo dito na mag-take a breather or kailangan ninyo dito na magdahan-dahan muna kayo. You have so much time, okay? Huwag ninyong pilitan na magawa ninyo ang lahat-lahat, no? Everything all at the same time, Pisces. Maaaligaga kayo, may stress kayo dyan, ano? Kaya ang... Ang invitation sa inyo din dito, give yourself permission na mag-slow down kayo, mag-chill muna kayo, mag-kalma lang, no? Kalma lang, Pisces. So, we have thrive. There's enough space for the moon and her stars not to tear each other down. And so, this is a time for you to thrive, to evolve, to, ano, to, um, uh, to grow, di ba, Pisces? Kaya, Take advantage of those opportunities for sure. There are multiple opportunities na kakatok sa buhay ninyo na mag, mag, uh, lalapit sa inyo dito pa kayo, para kayo ay mag-evolve, para kayo ay mag-thrive, para kayo ay mag-grow. Okay? So, we have light. Without the dark, we'd never see the stars. Ayan. So, totoo, ba? Diba? Kung hindi tayo dumaan sa madilim, hindi tayo naka-experience ng darkness sa buhay natin, hindi natin ma-appreciate ma or hindi natin makikita ang liwanag, hindi ba? Kung hindi tayo nag-fail at some point sa buhay natin, hindi natin mas ma-appreciate ang tagumpay, no? So, what else for Pisces? Blue star, follow the light of your inner compass, the blue star. It will lead you to the truth that resides within your soul. Ayan. So, yung inner compass na ito ang sinasabi nito, this is your intuition. This is your inner voice. This is your inner guidance, no? So, you're being invited here to follow, listen, no? And follow uh, your inner compass because ito yung gagabay sa inyo kung saan kayo papunta. Kung ano yung best na 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 pupuntahan ninyo ano ang best ninyong gagawin ano so this is divine guidance Pisces no this is divine guidance na parating sa inyo kaya um ma mabuti or it's 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 best for you to listen and follow what your inner voice is telling you dahil you are being propelled towards whatever is best na tahakin ninyo sa ngayon. Siguro ang iba sa inyo ngayon, nasa gitna ng sitwasyon na kailangan ninyong magdesisyon. Ano? Kaya ito yon merong gabay na binibigay sa inyo ang, ang divine universe uh, through your intuition. Kaya pakinggan nyo po yan. Okay? We have release. Release anything that keeps you from path of authenticity. Ayan. So, kung ano man, yung hindi man nagsiserve ng iyong highest good, it's time to let them go. No? Totoo, it's easy said than done, but you really need to try. Diba, gawin ninyo yan dahil yan ang makakabuti para sa inyo, okay? Panahon na para mag-let mag go, no? Kahit ano man yan na hindi na nag, nag, nagsusupport ng iyong social growth, hindi, nag, hindi nagsaserve ng iyong best interest, uh, wag na ninyong lagyan ng, pan, ng oras yan or espasyo sa, sa sarili ninyo. Para nang sa gayon, you can make room for newness so that you can welcome uh, newness, no positive things, people, situation, experiences, no? Uh, you need to make room sa sarili ninyo by letting them go, okay? We have reflection. See all aspects of yourself through reflection of the one who mirrors your hidden self. Ayan. So, panahon ngayon, Pisces, para magmuni-muni kayo. No, it's time for you to think about things that are happening sa buhay ninyo. Ano yung mga 
bagay sitwasyon na kailangan ninyong pagtuunan ng pansin, di ba? Ano yung dapat na priority ninyo? Ano dapat yung mga uh, bagay-bagay na inaasikaso ninyo, di ba? So, you really need to do some kind of reflection for you to be able to, ano, to figure that out para makita ninyo ano ang sitwasyon talaga ninyo, ano yung priorities ninyo, anong makakabuti para sa inyo, ano na yung mga nagawa ninyo, at ano pa yung hindi, ano pa yung kailangan pang gawin. Diba, Pisces? Good luck. That's all I have for you for today. Thank you for watching. Love and light. Namaste.